People across mid Michigan are still dealing with the pounding wind and rain we saw yesterday. Carroll Middle School is drying out after experiencing significant flooding. TV 5's James Felton reports school leaders say it's a constant problem they're working to address. It was just so much rain at, in, in such a short time that uh, the system just couldn't handle it. Carroll Public Schools Superintendent Pete Newman knew it was going to be a wet Wednesday at the middle school. Severe storms pounded the area, bringing with them tropical rains that left two to three feet of standing water in parts of that building Tuesday night. We had to have carpet people come out. They were great, uh, took care of us. We weren't, you know, none of the kids missed school. Everything started on time. Newman tells us this was some of the most intense rainfall he's ever seen during his time in Carroll. He says he feels bad for the maintenance staff who worked so hard over the summer to get these offices in tip top shape, only to have Mother Nature wash those efforts away. It's shiny and and beautiful and clean when the kids and the, and the teachers come back. So, yeah, it's, it's kind of disappointing. It's, you know, to have to clean up after, you know, all the work that they did. And here is the problem. Newman tells us when the water falls, it all flows downhill toward the middle school. And this is an issue he is trying to address so this mess stops happening. We got to figure out if it's a sewer issue or it's an engineering issue or, or what's going on there. But uh, I'm working with, you know, some local, you know, some local contractors, um, engineering companies that are going to come out and help us out and make sure that uh, we don't have, you know, we don't have prolonged extensive damage, you know, uh, in the future. Reporting in Tuscola County, James Felton, WNEM TV5.